Yeah. Free beer and hot wings in the morning. Grand Rapids rocks all day. 97.9 GRD rocks. Cloudy today, more mild. Some showers remain a possibility. Uh, 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 virtually a guarantee. It it's raining like it right now, right so I feel, like, I feel like that guarantee is going to be uh, Yeah, stamp that one closed. Yeah, absolutely. Done and done. We like to be sure. Yeah. Uh, I don't think we'll see sun today since it looks like um, the gloomiest place on earth right now again. No, yeah, it's uh, that's not happening. Yesterday was nice. Let me look outside to make sure. Yeah, no sun. <laughs> Yesterday was nice. I, I drove for a little while with my window down. I mean, heat blasting, but... It's just such a nice feeling to have air in the car. Like, oh. Yeah, I agree. I did the same thing. I'm like, okay, well, I'll just leave this down for a little while. Now I'm cold. Yeah, it was. Joy's it was over. Still very chilly, but because there was sun, it was easy to think, oh, it's sunny. Let's put this window down. Uh, Wood TV 8 had a news story about residents who are worried about a, a bar opening that offers a new event. Um. This seems weird to me that it would be a big concern, but let's hear the yeah, story. Yeah, I don't know why. Also, uh, I've never heard of this before. No. It's big on the other side of the state. Um, I know a lot of people, like people that I went to high school with, post about going. They're into this. Okay. Yeah, it's a, you know. I'm so intrigued, it's big in that. There's a big place in Detroit or Hamtramck or something that yeah. they do this. I like games. Ever heard of Foling? It's a bar game with ties to Detroit and will soon be taking over the old family fair in Cascade Township. Ah, but the plans for the building are striking a nerve with some neighbors. Good one. 24-Hour News mm -hmm. 8, Sarah Hurwitz was at a township meeting tonight. The community came out, they voiced their concerns. They're calling these people those folks just turkeys. Mm, yes. oh Hard boy. to pin someone down yeah. on this. They'd like to put this idea right down the gutter. <laughs> If I could, I'd strike you. That's not what you should say. <laughs> no, no, no. Finding You're out a about very this. violent man, right. aren't you? A lot of uh, questions, a lot of confusion, actually, about the decision that was made about this business. And a number of issues that were raised tonight, noise being a main one over a unique bar called Foling Warehouse, where you bowl with a football instead of a bowling ball. It's a hybrid sport that's growing in popularity. A sticker of what it once was posted next to its locked doors. I believe they have the right to run their business however they want, but it might not meet with what's appropriate for our neighborhood. But neighbors are hoping what goes in here next at the former family fair isn't this. What, the hockey horn store? Oh, what is that? Okay, what? all right. You yeah. know what? I can see that complaint. Yeah. Uh, maybe just tone down the hockey horn a yeah. little bit. Well, it can't it, be that big of a deal. Put in some insulation. Is that essential I mean, to the game? Well, plus you wouldn't think it would need to be that loud inside of a metal box. Yeah, I think the only option is to take the air horn out to this community and see if they're disturbed. I yeah, think let's that's see, a let's see what idea. Yeah, let's I mean, see what happens. Yeah, I mean, a test run. But also... Is this in a neighborhood? I mean, it, it's it's, it's a strip, near homes. Uh, I mean, everything in this town ball. is near homes. Yeah, you know, in one place or another. But how close can it that possibly was a, be? That was a family fair. I mean, I guess there aren't any businesses that are loud next to it. This right. certainly would be the loudest with their hockey horn. But again, it can't be that hard to muffle the inside of a building. Right. No. Put up some insulation. Yeah, whenever we blast the horn here, I don't see everybody getting all upset and cranky about the noise. No, you can't hear it outside. No, you don't hear it outside. You can only hear it right here in this room and then through the radio. That's it. Yep. No one's ever right. heard it outside no. of that. Or no. down the hallway. No, down there maybe. Four neighbors played at the commission meeting tonight. They say sounds off at the current falling warehouse in Metro Detroit. It's called the Bonk Honk. So if um, somebody first throws a game... They get the middle pin off and nothing else. It's called a bonk, and they will blow a bonk honk. Owner Laura a bonk Sullivan honk. Okay, fine. It just says she's working on ways to soundproof so the horn noise doesn't travel to neighboring homes. And she says this building at 28th and Cascade was big enough for the business. The Grand Rapids market is growing, and she felt it was a perfect fit. We have found that we just don't have issues. People come with their friends. People come with their families. They do their activity, and they leave. Um, there's not a, a lot of loitering in the parking lots, and as far as noise, putting in no. A this is a, this would be less like a bar than a regular bar. Yeah, where people literally just go to drink. I mean, right, people yeah. drink there, obviously, but it's a place where people go to have fun. 
Yeah, it's probably not a place that people are going to be, oh, I'm going to close it down, wait till no. 2 a.m., try to pick up some chicks in the uh, parking lot. No, Can't no, and it's not going to be a hotbed of fights or anything. I mean, it's not like there aren't any bars in Cascade yeah. near homes. Right. So other than just the noise, if they can muffle that, I don't see what the problem is. Also, they, they could just make the horn quieter. Let me save you some money on sound deadening. Make yeah. the horn a little quieter. Yeah, it doesn't maybe, need to be that loud. Yeah, it doesn't seem like it would need to be that loud in a giant metal building. Maybe but. they don't know that they're moving to the home of the world's number one air horn manufacturer. The people at Hadley will help you out. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you'll get the right sound. A smaller horn. Yeah. yeah. The That's right tone. Need. The right volume. I would let them move in. Because it's better than an empty strip mall. Yeah, right. Where people are going to be uh, becoming intoxicated, it might cause harm. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, why your is this, put why you is up this, to this child speaking right. at the town council meeting? Yes, because otherwise there's no drinking in Cascade. We all know that. Yeah. I, okay. Whatever. I used to be able to go and drink milk in the little cafe at the family fair. Now it's an empty building filled with prostitutes. <laughs> what? It's so much better for the town just to have this giant, ugly, abandoned eyesore <laughs> We've been saying, where no one's doing anything fun. We said, hey, you know what? Make Cascade look like Kentwood. Empty. I want, you know, right now the only thing in there is a dry cleaner and a pet smart, and I want it to stay that way. Uh, anyone really just, you know, pedestrians. But this girl what? and I shouldn't be walking know- across a parking lot. The presence of alcohol poses dangerous risks for the neighborhood. It does not. Uh, well, I mean, it does, but there's already booze in the neighborhood. Yeah, eight, there is. Eight feet in front of that building is Cascade Roadhouse. Right. You know what they serve there? Alcohol. <laughs> right. You know what's Cascades. right next to that? A packaged liquor store. Really? Yes. Oh, Cascade boy. Liquors. She it's right it. there. Whoa. Didn't she have Google Earth before she put her speech together? Wait, it's you're telling literally me right there. This isn't one of those dry towns that no, where nobody not. drinks. It's not. Now, I mean, whoa. I guess in in uh, in her defense, I haven't gone into Cascade Liquors and bought uh, so much that I blacked out from it. So may, I mean, maybe right. some people yeah. do that. I don't. Know. And while the community voices concerns to the planning commission tonight, it's not the governing body who approved that resolution for the business's liquor license last month, but they will be able to voice some of their concerns on Wednesday. There's actually a board meeting then, and we are also told that the owner will be there, so she'll be taking questions and I concerns. I hope she wins. Yeah. The noise there, is one a, thing, but don't give me any of this garbage no. about uh, booze being served. It's not. I mean, that is not a problem. Get out of here. Well, it's just like the casinos, guys. You know, wherever a casino opens, or Organized crime goes through the roof. Yes, right. of course, that's true. Yeah. That is, uh, yeah. that's a fact. Yeah, I do not blame them over noise at all. No. I would not want to be hearing a hockey horn at 1130 nope. at night or whatever. I don't nope, even know what I, their hours I mean, are. I don't think but I feel could... like that's fixable that without trying fixable. to keep them from opening. That's I mean, you really can't have easy. A, you can't have a bar like that anyway. I mean, that's already something they would have to deal with. It would right? be a noise ordinance. Yeah. Yeah, so I don't understand the problem there. And then in terms of the booze it well it could be any bar opening up right i mean to me you're gonna have far less issues there than it's something that's a dedicated bar where you know every time there's a sporting event people are gonna go in mass and there's gonna be 500 people they're bombed mm-hmm. maybe they just don't want booze in that building do we know why there's no family fair there anymore is it because they were selling booze they ran about th- a town with pitchforks i think mostly it's because it that's was, our sacred building i think mostly it's because it was about a quarter mile from the dnw yeah and a mire yeah. 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 And then, yeah, the mire is right down the road. So that was probably the big factor. Yeah. So uh, they closed the one that was the dumpiest. That warehouse that they were showing there when we saw the foaling. Yeah. That's what that's their establishment over in Detroit. I ass- Yeah. Or just a. I ass- well, well, I, I know, they I said Grand Rapids the is a growing market. They which did. Made I me know. think that there well, must I, be one here that I just didn't know I, about. I assume they mean just in general it's a growing market. Yeah. That's probably but it also would be a growing market for foaling. It looks fun. Every time I've seen my friends do it, I go, that looks fun. It's like bowling and cornholing and football all I would rolled do into it. one. I would yeah. do it. And you don't, you know, you don't have to be a great athlete to do it. You don't have to throw it that far. You just have to throw it straight. It's cheap, too. It's $10. You can play as long as you want. Whoa. Wow. Because they want you to play and buy drinks. Right. Yeah. Smart. That's smart. That yeah, is. it is smart. You know, like other bars where there's activities. Mm-hmm. But unless mm. they have a horn, I'm not going. Yep. Yeah, I'm not I want going the neighbors to, to yell. I, I want the horn. That's what I want. That's my entertainment. Well, actually, yeah, I'm only what? drinking at Hockey Goal from now on. It really doesn't matter. We can just bring That's our. It. We can just bring our own.
Yep. Or sometimes they'll go to the suburbs and go to tornado warning. Mm-hmm. I like going. But that's there. always fun when we get out the. I love it on those days. What's it? The first Tuesday of the month where we go to your yeah. car. First Friday at noon. Yep. Yeah. Everybody Bre- brings a flask. Break. Yeah. I don't like to drink unless my ears hurt. Yeah. So that's good. Well, it's you know it's excitement of some sort. Guys, it's your favorite Lincoln Park song, "Faint." Every time I hear this, I think it's a Britney Spears song. It I starts know. like this. Toxic. Toxic. It starts the same. It does. Do we Is have it the same toxic? song? Yeah. I've heard that. Can we hear Toxic? No. Oh. All right. Nope. Yeah, I want to hear that comparison. You I can't. think it's the same beginning. You can't. Nope. It is the same beginning. You can only hear Linkin Park. It's faint. 97.9 GRD Rocks.